Now to the growing questions about the death of former Zappo CEO Tony Shea. He passed away more than a week after being pulled from a burning Connecticut home. And new images from that scene are now adding to the mystery. The mystery deepening. A fire and former Zappo CEO Tony Shea dying from smoke inhalation. And today a look at the damage. These pictures from the DailyMail.com showing no damage to the front of the home. And in the back, the storage unit where the first responders found the billionaire entrepreneur trapped, also no major damage. The only sign of a fire, darkening on the top corner of one of the doors. I a fire in the building, one person stuck inside. The fire happened in the early morning hours of November 18th. And according to police, Shea was locked inside that storage area at the back of the home when firefighters arrived. The mail is barricaded, but he's not answering the door. Everyone else is outside the house. They're trying to get him to open up. You have a report of a person trapped. You make sure our paramedics is funny. Shea was rushed to a hospital with severe injuries before being transferred to a burn center. The medical examiner ruling his death an accident, attributing his death to smoke inhalation. The cause of the fire still under investigation. Shea was known as the most unconventional boss in America. Living in a 240 square foot trailer in downtown Las Vegas with his pet alpaca, Marley. Giving a tour to ABC's Rebecca Jarvis, the Zappos headquarters just blocks away. In 2009, the Harvard grad sold the online shoe retailer to Amazon for $1.2 billion, but remained on as CEO until this past August. His longtime friend, Amanda Slavin, said she saw him three weeks ago, just one week before he died. I would always give him like really silly gifts, like he loved llamas, so I would give him like llama eraser. Again, there's not a lot of people that just give you permission to be yourself always, and that was just, that's just him. Slavin says Tony was generous and humble with big plans for the future. Tony has been my mentor, uh, my partner. I might get emotional, but more importantly, um, my friend for the past eight years. And he changed my entire life. Still a lot of unanswered questions. And Tony Shea was set to celebrate his birthday in just over a week. His friends say they're trying to plan a way to honor and celebrate him on that day.